back to the pudding. I'm Cindy. Ryan, and today we are at Taman Esan trying yes. this long time char siu or uh, wonton min restaurant. Yes, this restaurant that has like yeah, around 30 to 40 years of mistaken. Thing is around 70 years old, but today his son is cooking, not him. Okay, let's try your Alright. Let me see that first. Pass you. Yeah, it's not that bad. Looks good, but it's not the very charred version, but it's like more like a lighter charred version. Looks pretty good. So now I'm gonna try the noodle. The noodle, as you can see, looks very springy. Taste the same. And then you definitely can taste the egginess of the noodle. And then the char siu, right? It's not that very size, but it's still a vegetable size. Lah. Still an enjoyable size. And then there's a sweet taste to the char siu. And let's try your beef. Right. This is the beef tendon. And then, right, when if you are lucky, you can only get the white radish. Because right, the white radish, uh, it's not every time you come then you have no like once in a while you're lucky then maybe the boss like will give you one or two pieces of white radish. Yes, it's very precious. Okay. Right, so let me just try the white radish. As you can see the fiber all is still intact. Looks very good. Cheers. Mm. Mm. When you guys try right? Drink the white radish soup. There's like this sour, sour little white radish flavor. It's still in there, and then it mixed with the herbal dishes of the soup, the beef tendon soup. So like it has the herbal taste and then the sour taste of the white radish. It's overall pretty good. And then now let's try the beef tendon. As you can see, the beef looks very soggy, soggy. One dance a little bit. All right, so let's try. I can taste the thin layer fat and then the beef meat very tender. It's not those tough beef meat, you know, like very hard to bite, but it's very tender. Very good, very good. And then the beefiness and then with the herbal dishes of the bitterness of the soup it makes a pretty good mix. Okay. So guys, so this is the other two parts of the beef. One is the which is near the stomach area and then for this part right it's actually near the lung, lung level right so now I'm gonna try this first the beef stomach mm. it's like beef chewing gum it's not just like tough tough meat lah don't get me wrong but it's like chewable chewing gum The meat just absorbs all the essence of the soup. And another thing, I really like this one. It's super thick and super You definitely can taste the herbal of the soup. Like very tau, very strong thick for your morning. Yes. No joke. So for this beef tendon soup, right, it comes with this chili. I believe this tastes like, you know those Kai uh, chicken rice chili. Right, so let me try how it tastes first. Personally, I prefer the original taste. I really don't, I'm not a fan of the chili, but if you like Kai Fan chili and you prefer like something special, you can try this, the combination of this two. Now it's my turn. I ordered soap. Soap noodle. And can't wait to try. First, eat the noodle. The noodle has eggy taste. Yeah. The eggy taste in it. Wow. It's like the, at different one time in store. I think this serves the best. Try the soup. The broth is the soul of this soul of the Let's try it. Hey. The tasu is good 
combination with all the noodles. For one time, I always leave it to the last. This is my practice. Of The one time the meat inside is very tight in together mm, and it's very smooth when you enter into the mouth. Too good. Chili? Yummy! Chicken feet is a Chinese cuisine. Many of the westerners really like discuss about it. But this is my favorite. As this you can see right. Wow. See, just split into half. And this sauce is very silky and a lot of collagen in it. See that? Wow. Okay, so Brian, it's your turn. Usually, right? This is like a must order thing for my father when every time he comes here. So, yes. Uh, I think Daddy's you, favorite. After you guys try this, I think you guys know why he order it that often. So, let's try our first bite for this chicken feet. As you can see, the meat is tender, the skin is tender, everything is tender. Nice. Looks good, feels good, that's good. There is a sweetness in the meat. Because right, when sometimes you eat chicken feet, either the leg part right, don't have meat, you know, just like only skin only. But this one got a thin layer of meat and then skin as well. So overall it's pretty good, pretty good and then kind of sweet. Oh, you can't eat really politely with this because when you eat it, it, quite, it, it, it is quite a mess. So, okay, so it, how I eat it is I just put the front part of the feet just in my mouth and just like uh, spit out those bones. So, it's, it's not a table etiquette. Mm. After we eat, how do you feel? Alright, pretty all, I think the consistency is there, then yeah. everything is pretty good, like this is there, it's the right spot, then yeah. So this is the 10 out of 10 thing that they yeah. won't go any wrong. Uh. Yeah, so I want to make more tempting, very more tempting, so very nice. Pretty yeah. all, standard stuff, right there. So Couldn't go wrong. You should come here again. Yeah, alright. So see you next time.